And CBS 17's Joseph Holloway has been monitoring the roads throughout the morning. We also have now got meteorologist Lance Blocker taking controls. So Lance, where are you and how are things looking? Yeah, Bill, we're headed southbound right now. Conditions, of course, just like Laura was talking about, not too bad. We do expect to, to deteriorate as we move through the afternoon, though you can see from the dash cam off the Chevy Weather Beast that uh, it's just some light rain right now. And that's really just in line with what our forecast was so far today. But the chance for severe weather is there later on this afternoon. Check out the radar, just like Laura was talking about earlier, where that surge of moisture now beginning to lift northward. If you stepped outside today this morning, probably didn't think, well, today is a day we could see severe weather. It doesn't feel that way, but that is likely to change as that warm Gulf moisture or warm Atlantic moisture, that is, gets drawn northward, just like what we're seeing on radar, that line out to the west will continue to strengthen and move eastward. We do expect to see those powerful thunderstorms, just like Laura was talking about, later on this evening. So we're heading southbound. We're actually going to be streaming live on Facebook and on YouTube for our YouTube uh, so our YouTube page, CBS 17, and of course on the website as well. We'll be streaming from the Weather Beast all day today, uh, keeping you advised what conditions are like on the ground. And again, you can see the winds coming out of the southeast. That's going to bring that unstable air back into our region. The best threat for tornadoes or the highest risk areas will be down to the southeast towards Fayetteville and Clinton. That's why we're in the Weather Beast heading in that general direction to keep you updated on that. For now, we'll send, you, we'll send it back to you guys in studio. All right, Lance, thank you. Be safe out there.